been over, there's been a lot of talk about what the results in the White House and in Congress could mean for tax reform. I'm Erin Stackley and I'm joined today by Evan Lydiard to talk about the potential impact on commercial real estate tax issues. Now that the election is over, what are your initial thoughts on what Republicans have proposed for tax reform? Well, that's a very good question. Republicans generally like the idea of tax incentives to try to incentivize more economic growth and create new jobs. Along with that, simplicity. So I think those will be the two keys. And how that translates to the real estate, commercial real estate market is going to be interesting to see. Okay. And where would you put the likelihood of tax reform actually happening in the 115th Congress? If you're talking about moving towards tax reform and, and moving on it and act, actually trying to enact it, I think it's very high, 90% plus. Actually getting it done, I would put more like 55 to 65%. And with Republicans in control of both Congress and the White House, why do you still put that so low? Well, 50, 55 to 65% is not exactly low. It's more likely than not, but people forget that we still have Senate Democrats, and Senate Democrats are able to filibuster things they don't like. So having a tax reform before the, the Senate is going to take some bipartisan compromise, and that can really throw a wrench into it because if you have the House on one side that really is looking forward to a conservative pro-Republican plan and it gets diluted over in the Senate, that, that can make it a lot harder to pass. I still think it's more likely than not, but certainly not a done deal, not, not a, a, a sure thing. And what do you think that tax reform could look like? Will it be positive or negative for commercial real estate? It's a mixed bag. On the positive side, we're likely to see tax cuts, which is a, a good thing for commercial real estate, and more infrastructure spending, which also could benefit real estate, both directly and indirectly. On the negative side, though, they're also talking about denying the deductibility of business interest, which is with, with real estate being such a highly leveraged industry, that could be a, a, a tough thing. Another thing on the positive side is the idea of immediate expensing of buildings. Now that sounds fantastic. Instead of having 39 years of depreciation for real estate to be able to do it in one year, that could be a very positive thing. But much of it is going to depend on the details and how it's done. So. Turning to a couple specific issues for commercial real estate, obviously Section 1031 like-kind exchanges are huge for our commercial members. And we also have had a lot of talk about carried interest. What do you think the fate of those two specific issues are in the next Congress? Carried interest has become the poster child of tax fairness ever since the 2012 presidential campaign. And members on both sides of the aisle, significant numbers of them, have said that they want to change the tax treatment of carried interest so that it's ordinary income instead of capital gains. I think that it's not likely that we'll see any tax reform that does not change that tax, that tax treatment for carried interest. And on 1031, uh, it's uh, very, very likely that we'll see big movements to repeal it as well, or at least limit it. And I, I think that's the one most significant uh, item in danger from tax reform for commercial real estate is, is the 1031 like kind of exchange. Okay. Uh, switching gears to the remainder of 2016, do you think that Congress will take any action on tax issues during the lame duck session, specifically the tax extenders that are set to expire? Uh, good question. And many people have been focusing in recent weeks on these expiring tax provisions, and there are several important to the commercial real estate industry. There will be talk about doing that and perhaps some movement, but I think Republicans would rather wait and deal with this in tax reform next year. So I'd be surprised if it actually gets done, but we will see some discussion about it. 